Welcome to the Mint Report, a wrap-up of the day's business news. Here are the top stories. Government hangs Ajmal Kassab. World Bank says remittances to India will increase this year. And markets rebound on Wednesday. First up, the government has hanged Mohammad Ajmal Kassab. He was hanged secretly at 7.30 a.m. at a jail in Pune. Kassab was the sole surviving member of the group of Pakistani terrorists that attacked Mumbai on the 26th of November 2008. Kassabs is the first capital sentence to be carried out in India since 2004. Moving on, the economy may be in trouble. But India could get more overseas money this year via remittances. A new World Bank report says the country's remittances could increase to $70 billion in 2012. That's compared to about $58 billion in 2011. India continues to receive more remittances than any other country. Worldwide, remittances are projected to reach $406 billion in 2012, an increase of 6.5%. Switching to other news, the Reserve Bank may be stepping up pressure on banks to ease their rates. On Wednesday, Deputy Governor K.C. Chakrabarti said banks could reduce their interest rates even within the present monetary policy. Chakrabarti added that they were holding back because of the rising problem of bad loans. In the past, the Reserve Bank has indicated that it's concerned about both restructured loans and non-performing assets. And finally, Indian markets rebounded on Wednesday with value buying and a weak rupee pushing up some shares. The Sensex surged 131 points to 18,460 and the Nifty gained 43 to 5,614. Some banking and IT stocks were among the big winners. ICICI Bank rose 1.92% on the BSC with investors looking for a bargain. And Infosys climbed 1% to 2,348 rupees and 35 paise. And that's all we have for you. Thanks for watching.